Hey everyone, welcome back to Cyber School with Binta. And um, today what I just want to do is I want to read a book with you guys. And it is one of my favorite books. And it's called Dragons Love Tacos. Dragons Love Tacos by Adam Rubin. Illustrated by Daniel Salmieri. Hey kid, do you know that dragons love tacos? They love beef tacos and chicken tacos. They really love big gigantic tacos and tiny little baby tacos as well. Why do dragons love tacos? Maybe it's the smell from the sizzling pan. Maybe it's the crunch of the crispy tortillas. Maybe it's a secret. Either way, if you want to make friends with, ta with dragons, tacos are key. Hey dragon, why do you guys love tacos so much? But wait, as much as dragons love tacos, they hate spicy salsa even more. They hate spicy green salsa and spicy red salsa. They hate spicy chunky salsa and they hate spicy smooth salsa. If the salsa is spicy at all, dragons can't stand it. No spicy salsa. Salsa, no. Why do dragons hate spicy salsa? Well, just one drop of hot sauce makes the dragon's ears smoke. Just one single speck of hot pepper makes the dragon's snort sparks. Spicy salsa gives dragons the tummy troubles, and when dragons get the tummy troubles, oh boy. If you want to make tacos for dragons, keep toppings mild. Tomatoes, check. Lettuce, check. Cheese, check. These are all good toppings for tacos for dragons. Hey dragon, how do you feel about spicy toppings? Oh, this dragon does not like it. Dragons love parties. They like costume parties and pool parties. They like big gigantic parties with accordions and tiny little parties with charades. Why do dragons love parties? Maybe it's the conversation, maybe it's the dancing, maybe it's the comforting sound of a good friend's laughter. The only thing dragons love more than parties or tacos is a taco party. Taco parties are parties with lots of tacos. But if you wanna have some dragons over for a taco party, you'll need buckets of tacos, pant loads of tacos. The best way to judge is to get a boat and fill the boats with tacos. That's about how many tacos dragons need for a taco party. After all, dragons love tacos. Hey dragon, are you excited for the big taco party? He's marking it on his calendar. <clears throat> Just remember, dragons hate spicy salsa. Before you host your taco party with dragons, get rid of all the spicy salsa. In fact, bury the spicy salsa in the backyard so the dragons can't find it. He's burying the spicy salsa. <gasps> These dragons love your taco party. They love the music, they love the decorations, they especially love the tacos. Congratulations! And he has his I Love Tacos shirt. <clears throat> It's a good thing you got rid of all that spicy. Wait a second. What are those little green things in the salsa? You didn't read the fine print? Totally mild salsa. Now with spicy jalapeno peppers. Oh my gosh. <gasps> Dragons, listen to me. Do not eat those tacos. Those little green specks in the salsa, those are jalapeno peppers. They're super spicy, and I know you love tacos, dragon, but you are not gonna love those. Do not let those dragons eat those tacos. Crunch, crunch. <gasps> What's going on? Their ears are smoking because dragons do not love spicy salsa. So their ears are smoking and they're breathing fire out of their mouths. Oh no. What happened to the house?
Now that we, we burned the house down, what do we have to do? Well, the top, the dragons burned the house down. What do we have to do? Rebuild the house so they can have a place to stay. But why would dragons help you rebuild your house? Maybe they're good Samaritans. Maybe they feel bad for wrecking it. Maybe they're just in it for the taco breaks. But this time, I hope you remembered no spicy salsa. After all, dragons love tacos. Like I said, this is one of my favorite books. And when I read books, I'm quite animated um, because the goal is for the kids to enjoy it. I already know how to read. I know what the story is. I've read the book before I even ordered it for the class. So I want them to be engaged. It's about them being engaged and how I can help them, meaning the children, think that this is fun and, and, and great. And so the changing of voices and the just the exclamation points, like following the punctuations, those are all really helpful um, when reading with children. So I hope you enjoyed Dragons Love Tacos and see you again.